get it. All right. It's the Tuesday Nighter Classic. Fishing with my boy, HPS fishing. Yeah, buddy. Two o'clock, we got to fish till eight. Solid six hours. She throwing. Nice. I like this could pull one out of those. Hundred percent. This is like this watercolor is so nice for this fish. Like I can see this bait the whole way back. Up under me. Sorry, I'm trying to slow us down a little bit. The money cast. Got him. Throw him in. He counts. God, broke me off. Yeah. Throw a. Uh, the call tags are in here. Hunter caught the first fish of the day. No size limit on these bad boys. He's like dialed, you know, two thirds of a half a pound. He's kind of fat. Hey guys, it's Thursday. So you know what that means? It's time to take a look at the boat of the week sponsored by Angler's Choice. This week, we're taking a look at a lightly used 2017 Triton Boats 18 TRX. If you like red, this boat is definitely gonna be up your alley. This 18 TRX is an 18 foot eight inch hull with a 94 inch beam. It's powered by a 150 horsepower Mercury Optimax. Up front on the bow, you've got an 80 pound thrust Minn Kota Fortrex. And as far as electronics, we have a Lowrance HDS7 live at the console and a Lowrance Elite 7 HDI up at the bow. This boat has an awesome layout. Hunter has this same exact boat and I've fished off of it many, many times. There's plenty of storage, plenty of space in the live well. And again, like even though it's an 18 foot boat, one of the last BFLs that we fished, Hunter had like 40 rods in his rod locker. Again, plenty of storage in this 18 foot boat. It's a really clean looking Triton overall. So if you have any interest in the boat of the week, I'm gonna leave it linked down in the description below. I'll leave two links down there for it. One for the boat itself, and then one for a lead form that you can fill out and get in touch with one of the awesome salesmen over at Angler's Choice. They've also got a few other promotions going on right now. Actually, I wanna say three big ones. One being that the inflation busters are still going on so you can save up to 10 grand on the 2023 Ranger 520R and 521Rs. English Choice is running a promotion with Mercury right now, so if you're looking to repower your boat, they will take your old motor off your boat, help you sell that, hang the new motor on the back, and they're waiving all service charges for installation. They've also got some deals going on with the new 2023 Tritons. They have three in stock right now. You can save between eight and $10,000 on those. And last but not least, all of the new boats that I was just talking about qualify for the $2,000 gift card for Bass Pro and along with a really nice cover that would go with the boat. English Choice also has over 600 boats in stock. So even if you're not looking for a Ranger or a Triton, you can click the link and go see what they have. And beyond just Ranger Triton Nitro, they have a bunch of consignment boats and lightly used boats in stock as well. So there are a ton of options over at Angler's Choice. And if you're looking for a new or lightly used boat, it's the place to go. I literally just retied this last night too. I might've just done a bad knot. It was kind of dark. Get on it. Ah. I really don't even want to throw this thing in there. Ah. I think this is smaller than yours. Again, just reiterating, there's no size limit. <laughs> I feel bad even putting this cold tag on this thing. It's too big. <laughs> Mm -hmm. We got about three quarters of a pound right now, dude. I don't think we have a pound. I don't think we do either. I was able to catch a couple on Friday too, just throwing a little Kitek through bait balls that I saw. I was like swimming around. Well, if we get a limit of those, we'll have like a pound and a half. Yeah, that would be sick. It's a good start. 
it was kind of like up and down. I went to one yeah. group and there was a bunch of like little posts. So I think they were like, Dude, I'm gonna lose it. That just it just popped off. Like Was it a was it a good fish? It didn't feel that good because of how loose my drag is and I just had them coming straight up. I couldn't I don't, I don't think it was I think it was another seven inch. Uh, it was probably bigger than that, but I don't think it was no, like no. I don't think it was big. I'm like kind of trigger shy right now. No, I just didn't give him the juice. That's a bluegill. Other one felt a little bigger. I am just, I gotta redeem myself, dude. I'm sorry. Oh, they're here. I think I got one. Got one. Yeah. Nope. Pulled it out of his mouth. Small. Well, guess what? That's number three. He's That's going in. Dude, we need to get rid of all these. Is this the biggest of all time? I think this is the smallest. So will. All right, I think we got about a pound now, buddy. He ain't that good, oh. but he's good enough. He's better than nothing. Biggest fish of the day. He was stuck on the other side of that pole at first. When I set the hook, he didn't budge. Go throw at that, um, like the face of the dock. He, there was like three or four good ones. It looked honestly bigger than this. The group I was casting at. Dude, I thought. Yeah. I thought he was gonna be a lot bigger, but hey, he is a lot bigger. Number four going in, it is 317. Look at how responsible I'm being. Three times? I'm just gonna do it. Oh, be a fun way to catch a couple real fast. Got him? Take your time. I think this is the move, dude. them up they're they are fighting like ridiculously hard too i got you oh not yet not yet my drag said it takes off you good take your time keep letting him fight he's not that big i just no nah, he's he's fighting good that's a that's a three bingo i think it will buddy I think that'll Drop eat, eat oh, our other ones. That's a three pounder. Okay. Yeah. Is that number five? Yeah. Never! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's a bite. One? Yeah. It's not small. Honestly, it's rolling around like a catfish. Yeah. Not bad. Coco. Cool. Oh God. I don't know how to use one of these. Hang on, let me. Sure. Yeah. You want to take the front? You're dialed. I'm dialed. Nice. Hey, that'll work, buddy. I mean, that'll gain us a, a, at least a pound at and a quarter. A pound. Basically, however much that fish weighs is what it'll call right. us. Let's go. Which one's smaller? That one's smaller, yeah. Right. Throw that back. Number three stays. Dude, that's so, so bad. What? Oh. oh, we needed okay. that. Should I throw it up there? You want to see it? Yeah. That's what they be eating. He's like three inch shed. Small. Oh.
Don't tell me. Dude. I gotta retie this. Oh my god, I think he does get call. smaller every time I look at him. I know. Ow. Oh. I think he does. Look at these fish. Look how small they are. Uh. All right, power left. You good? You need to back up? Huh? It's all about the angles. Oh, that's a cold. Yeah! Never, ever, 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 ever give up. Hey, that's a cold, baby. Yo. Let me move a little bit. Oh yeah. That'll do it. Yes, it will. We got a few coals left in us, boy. What time is it? 6.50? 6.50. It's gonna happen. Drop shots, docks, drop shots, docks. Confidence off the charge right now. Whoa. Oh, just had one right there too. They are biting. Yep. Came back for it. Oh, tiny. Is that a cull? No. We're not even gonna. Dude, it might. No way. No, nah, it's not. It's definitely the way to do it. Break? That one's not small. Oh, he's decent. Can I just grab a net? I mean, he's not big, but oh! What kind of nonsense is that? Right at the net. <laughs> no. no, it was mine. I was forcing him a little bit. I don't think he would have pulled anyway. Yeah, I don't think so either. I should have retied that like five fish ago. Three more inches, he would have been in the net. 11 minutes. All right, let's just... Just down the bank? Yeah. I suppose... All right, I guess we gotta go. Let's go. Sorry, I suck. All right, so Hunter and I finished up the night with around eight pounds. We weren't really anywhere near the money, but we were able to get on some fish and cull a few times luckily because a bunch of those fish were like seven inches. It was a little rough, but hey, a limit's a limit. Sometimes those fish really can help and make a difference, but we couldn't pull it together. I ran into a few issues throughout the day of breaking fish off. I think I broke three fish off total. So I needed to figure that out. I don't know what was going on. I don't know if I had my drag too tight or if the piece of leader line that I'd tied on just wasn't great. But either way, that's eight pound test for you sometimes. I should have sat down and retied it, but it was a fun afternoon. Always good getting out with Hunter. I'm gonna leave him linked down in the description below. He's posting videos every week and he has a bunch of good content, so don't forget to check him out. Also, again, Boat of the Week's gonna be linked down below. Huge shout out and thank you to English Choice for sponsoring this video. I love fishing out of this Ranger. They're an awesome company to work with. I'd highly suggest going through them if you're looking to sell a boat, buy a boat, if you need any sort of tackle, acmtackle.com. And make sure you tell them that I sent you. That's where I'm going to leave this one off. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. We've got a ton of tournaments coming up. October is probably my most stacked month as far as tournaments go. And they're also all the biggest tournaments that I'll be fishing this year. So I am really looking forward to it. I cannot wait to get in the zone and just focus as much as I can on fishing these tournaments. And hopefully winning a little bit of money. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button for me and we'll see you on the next one.